everyone and welcome back to a brand new video, I'm your host Deeper Jungle and today I'm going to be doing a video and that's going to be a cut commentary here on Modern Warfare Remastered, so yeah let's get started. So in this video I'm going to be talking about a couple of different things and the first thing and that is this week I'm actually going to be trying to make kind of a YouTube comeback because if you actually did not know, the last couple of weeks I've been slacking just a little bit so now I'm going to be trying to get back into like that upload grind which is basically uploading on every weekday so yeah hopefully this week I can really start that up again as well as hopefully sometime this week I'm going to be getting the first part of a let's play series here on my channel and I think it's gonna be a lot of fun because the game I never uploaded it to my channel before and until that video goes live I'm going to be keeping this series under wraps however I can give you a couple hints for one it's not any Call of Duty or Battlefield game and until that video goes out you're going to have to speculate about what the game I'm actually going to be posting and you know what comment down below what you actually think the game is going to be alright guys so now the next topic that I'm going to be talking about and that's going to be my thoughts on the supposed Call of Duty 2017 leak so if you actually did not know the last couple days there's been quite a bit of a buzz in the Call of Duty community and that's just because there's been a supposed leak for Call of Duty 2017 and that leak is Call of Duty World War 2. So yeah in this video I decided to give my own two cents about what I think about the leak for Call of Duty 2017 because it's always quite a bit of fun because every single year at around this time there's always like this buzz going around about the newest Call of Duty game because there's always like these leaks from all these different websites and a lot of people like they go over them and they analyze them. And it's always quite a bit of fun to speculate about the newest Call of Duty game. So in this video I'm going to be kind of giving my two cents about Call of Duty World War 2 and do I think it's actually real? And in my own opinion I think it's a pretty good chance because I've actually seen a lot of the Call of Duty 2017 leaks because if you remember from about a month and a half ago they had Call of Duty People's Army which a lot of people thought Call of Duty 2017 was actually going to be. So it turned out to be fake because when people actually went into the code they found out that the images from like the working screen were actually from Bad Company to Vietnam so they realized that yeah this is completely fake and with this leak I think it's actually quite possible because the leak has actually been a couple days old and I don't think there's actually any people that's really confirmed that Call of Duty World War 2 is actually going to be fake because a lot of the times with these things within the first couple of days a lot of people notice some weird similarities like for example with Call of Duty People's Army they notice that like some of the textures and things like that were from other games and a lot of the times when it's like leaked Call of Duty trailers or leaked video game trailers they have like gameplay from like more obscure games that a lot of people don't know of. However, with Call of Duty World War II, there hasn't really been that. Now, this is not me saying that I think it's completely confirmed. However, I think it's a pretty good chance, and this is probably the most likely chance of all the leaks that came out for Call of Duty 2017 to actually be real. And I can prove this because if you actually did not know, the people that are actually leaking Call of Duty World War II were actually the people that got it right about Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. So that means they actually have a bit of a track record. Because a lot of the times, like the people that actually are leaking these Call of Duty games, many times they're actually just like some weird obscure website that just so happens to have Call of Duty 2017 information. However, these guys actually have a bit of a track record, so they're a little bit more credible than let's say a person that we never heard of before. And frankly, a lot of the evidence towards Call of Duty World War II is actually there. Like I remember Michael Condry in 2014 says that he would actually like to see a new Call of Duty World War II game back in 2014 before Advanced Warfare came out, as well as the really fit for bringing Call of Duty back to its roots because there's nothing more of Call of Duty's roots than World War II. The first three Call of Duty games and their expansion packs were completely World War II. And it being boots on the ground and a classic Call of Duty game, I think it is quite possible. Now, just keep in mind, this could be completely fake and a person could have just made this out of nowhere. There are some people that are Photoshop gods, like they can make anything and they can just create some of the most realistic leaks and rumors for video games. But in summary, I think it is quite possible for Call of Duty World War II to actually be real. And yeah, we will actually have to see because it is late March 2017, which means that more like confirmed leaks and rumors are going to be coming out in the next couple weeks. And then maybe about a month or two months from now, we're probably going to be getting a reveal trailer. So that's actually pretty exciting. And yeah, that has really been it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, please remember to leave a like as well subscribe if you are new and don't forget to click the bell to get a notification every single time i upload a new video so that's really been it for this video and i hope to see you in the next one